Hey guys, it's Otom here, and welcome to SCP Containment Breach 1.0.6. Now, I was going to finish the previous version before, you know, I started a new one. But, um, I don't know, I've, I've beat the game before, and we saw, you know, most of the new stuff in 1.0.5, so I thought, you know, we might as well go on to the next version. There's no point staying on the older version if I've the only thing left to do is beat the game, because... I don't think there's any new stuff to do with the ending, so there's not really much point because you know the ending's going to be the same as before when we saw it. So even though we did only see one of them, but still, here's the new version. Apparently, there's been an update to the intro. I think you, I think the main thing they've done is made it so you walk slower so that you don't overtake the guards. So yeah, blah blah, blah half SCP. You're probably going to die. Don't worry about it. Please sign here. <laughs> cool. Right. Hey, they've got some work for you. Do me a favor. Work. And step out of yourself. Okay. Just follow me. Oh, and by the way, this look kind of different. To kill any disobedient test subjects, so don't try anything stupid. Oh yeah, I walk slower. But yeah, so that's like the main thing I've done to the intro. Apparently, you walk slower so you don't overtake the guards now. Attention, please. But um, it's always nice to start a new game with this anyway, because I can always get for it quite quick. And you know, I always sort of I like to. Just in case they've added any new little things that, that yeah, weren't no, mentioned. Hey, today's pizza day down at the cafeteria, right? Pizza day. Uh, actually, I think it's tuna casserole. Oh, god damn it! Well, my day's ruined. The only reason I still come here is for the pizza. I don't know what it is about that pizza, but it's delicious. I swear I just saw something pop tuna up there. Tuna casserole, on the other hand, is a disgusting abomination, and it should be locked up in here with the rest of these freaks. <laughs> uh, okay. Someone's mad about tuna casserole. Jeez. All right. Well. Well, we're here. Just get in there and follow all the instructions, and uh, you'll probably be fine. Doubt it. You think your day's been ruined because there's no pizza? I'm pretty sure my day's about to get worse. Well, probably you know yours too. Here he is. All right. Well. There we go. Come on, hurry up. Get in. Uh, Alright. Please approach SCP-173 for testing. No thanks. <laughs> He's like, okay. I'll just walk up to him. Flash <laughs> nah. Oh god. Don't blink. Don't blink everyone. So Keep your eyes open. God, you can hear the rest of the facility breaching. Oh god. Not blinking. Not blinking. Oh god. Okay, right. There we go. He, j he jumped up there and done some parkour into the vent. Now we're on our way. I don't know if that saves him and press it again. Right, so. Apparently they've added new sound effects to the beginning. That apparently consist of... Oh, God. Uh, after the beginning of the game, like after the first sort of containment breach section, um... Apparently there's going to be like, you know, more gunfire effects in the background that you can hear and stuff. Oh my god, the tables are just sinking into the floor. Right, so I don't know, I'm not sure what else they've added. Close this. There's like a bit of a glitch over it, you can... Uh, See through the wall. What is that? See if I could make out what that is. That could be useful. What about this? I can. No. Okay. So well, there's something that way for sure. We know that now. I mean, we kind of always knew that anyway. But yeah. So here's the room with the level two key card. But I need the level one first. So I need to either find the repeating doorways or I need to find uh, the room with the gas mask in it. Preferably room with the gas mask if I can because obviously then I'll have the gas mask so it's much better but um yeah hopefully we're gonna have a good run I mean we usually have pretty decent runs now that I know what I'm doing right these are yeah the beeping sound confirms it it's uh there the rooms with the ring and the book and all that that's a dead end so that's kind of disappointing but we might need to go back there at some point so it's good to know Although I'll probably forget by next episode. 
But um, yeah, so let's keep going. Try and find this room. So, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm recording this. Uh, well, it'll be yesterday for you watching this. But yeah, sorry there was an upload last night. I was 100% up for recording. And then I ate my food and felt really sick. Like I felt like I was going to just throw up so bad. Uh, so I, And then by the time I felt better, it was like half nine. Which is now, funnily enough, for me. But uh, but yeah, so I thought well, I better record at least something for tomorrow. Because I'm not here. So this isn't going so well so far. We haven't really... We haven't really got anywhere just yet, but okay, so he's going to be here. He always is on the first time. I've learned that. Every time you go in these rooms for the first time, he's there. So it's blink. Open, open the door. There we go. Okay, right, he's still there. Just back up a bit. I can't tell if that sound was in real life outside or on the game. I hope it was on the game, otherwise it's... Okay, yeah, it was, in, it was in the game, it just happened again. That was freaky. Right, oh god, did I just... No, I thought the door opened behind me then. Right, okay, let's get going. Let's... Right, so here's the poem. The poem. But we can't go in there yet. So we need to go this way. I really, really need to find a level 1 keycard. If I can't find a level 1 keycard, pretty much can't do anything else. So, I need to find... Oh, okay, right, well, we won't go that way then. Yeah, so we can't do anything else until we find this keycard. So, I definitely need to find it. The heavy containment seems to be on the left in this run. It actually was in the last run as well. In the previous version... Where the hell is this? What's this? Oh, okay, so I'm going to leave that open because nothing bad can come out of that room. And it's good to leave it open so that it's more obvious, you know, if I'm sprinting around. So it's good, we found the upgrade room, so this is new. That is new. I have never seen that before. When you walk on it, it makes... Uh, pocket dimension sounds. Right, good. Level 1 keycard and the upgrade room is right around the corner, so... What? No, what? It's not here. What? Oh, that fucks that plan up a little bit, doesn't it? Um, it's meant to be a level one key card on the shelf. Apparently, it's not anymore. I don't know if that's a glitch or if that's happened on purpose. Now, I don't know. Maybe you have to go through it again, and then it's there. It's... Oh, okay. Yeah, that is weird, but that may that actually worked, right? So wait, if I go for it again, will there be a gas mask, maybe? Is this like a little... If I go for it, close the door, open it again. Oh, right, okay. So they're repeating rooms, but there's actually a separate set. So the first lot have the page and a battery. And then the second lot, by the looks of it, has the cup and the card. Anyway, enough making about we've got the card now. So now I just need to figure out... Right, here's the weird pocket image stuff. Yeah, if I'll be quiet, but look, when I walk on this, like this, this is even new, or I just haven't seen it before, but it's new to me anyway. But yeah, look, I'll be quiet, and when I walk over it, just listen to the sound effects. Um. Oh my god. Oh shit! Yeah, that's a new. Fi that's a fucking pocket dimension trap right there. Holy shit! I didn't know that was a thing. Do you know what? When I first saw it, right? What the hell? I can't see anything. This is so dark. Am I dead? <gasps> oh! Oh, his face just popped up. Am I dead? I don't know what's happening. I'm alive. Oh god, not for long. Sort your vision out. 173 is here. Sort your fucking vision out right now. 
Okay. Sort you sort it out. Come on. Snap out of it, man. Oh, right, we made it. I didn't know that was a thing. I'm gonna save the game. Maybe. I need this to sort out. Fix yourself, vision. Ah. Maybe if I blink a few times. I blink like really slow now. This is, I can't play like this if it's gonna stay like that. What the hell was that noise? I can't see. This is retarded. I can't see anything. Oh no. Does this ever go? I'm not actually sure. Have my eyes been like corroded? Is that what's happened? Will this ever sort out? Is it just going to stay like that? I'm going to have to... Oh. Oh, there we go. It's fixing. It's fixing. It's getting better. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we're good. We may be like half dead because we're wobbling all over the place, but I'm pretty sure we're okay now, so let's save the game. That was weird. I'd, I don't even know what to say about that. That was so weird. Wait, are we in... What am I supposed to do about this? It's put us in the entrance zone. I have a level 1 key card in the entrance zone. I can't even get back to the light containment zone. And I've just saved the game. I may have just fucked this run up straight away. Seriously. It's put me directly into the entrance zone. With no key cards. What am I supposed to do about this? That was a sneaky little trap. Okay, that was... Some bullshit. He just killed himself because of the butt ghost. But yeah, that was like... I sort of saw it and thought, mm, that could be like, if I walk on that, it might be like quicksand and I'll fall for it. And I thought, oh no, look, I've walked on it, it's fine, it just makes sound effects. So I was like, oh yeah, look, watch, I'll, I'll shut up so you can listen to the sound effect. And then, bloop, she fell for it like quicksand. I was like, well, probably should have paid attention. Right, just cut them off. Right, I am literally stuck. In the entrance zone with no cards. I can't open this door. I can't get back to the light containment. I can't get into heavy containment. I'm literally just walking around until I get shot. So I think I might have to start a new run next episode. But yeah, that was so weird. I don't even know what to say about it. Like, seriously, because. Oh, wait, is this. It is. Level 2. Right, that's good can i get into level can i get into light containment with that i'm not sure i think i might be able to get into light containment with that and here's the electric center so that's very good oh god that made me jump you'd think i'd be used to that kind of shit after now but oh level two opens this oh that was just a random guess I'd, i've never actually tried that before because i've never been here really i can't get up the stairs because i'm so injured What was disabled? I can't get upstairs because I'm too injured. Come on. Get up the stairs. Uh, right, I'm going to have to restart this because... Uh, I literally can't do anything. Right. Well, I'm going to have to save and quit. I don't know why I bothered saving. How long have I been recording? I don't even know. Right. Okay, well, that is going to have to be that for today. So... Yeah, that was really weird. I should have stuck with my initial, like, sort of gaming instincts. I thought to myself, big weird black puddle on the floor that, you know, sort of insinuates pocket dimension stuff. I sort of thought to myself, if I tread on that, I'm probably going to fall through the floor and go to the pocket dimension. Or maybe not necessarily go to the pocket dimension. But I sort of thought to myself, if I tread on that, something bad's probably going to happen. But then, the first time, nothing did. And then the second time, I was like, oh yeah, listen to the sound effect. Well, being all, like, stupid. And then, like stepped on it and bad things happened i'm now injured to the point where i can't walk upstairs and i've been randomly placed in the entrance zone with no key cards to get back to any of the other places so 
I'm going to start a new game next episode because, as I said, can't go upstairs, can't get out of this zone. So it's pretty stupid. Plus there's soldiers walking about. So yeah, next episode we'll be starting a new game. Uh, luckily we weren't actually that far in. We only had level 2 keycard. But yeah, so... Yeah, I'm going to end it there for today because that is all I have time for. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button or add the video to your favourites. Also, please do not forget to subscribe to the channel for more content. There will be more Containment Breach as well as other indie and horror games too. So if that's your thing, then you know, please subscribe to the channel because there will be lots and lots of videos on the channel. So yeah, and uh, again, thanks so much for watching. As always, I'll see you in the next video, and goodbye!